calculate the number of electrons in 1 coulomb of negative charge. If you want to do what you want to do, if you want to do one coulomb, you can do one coulomb. One coulomb is a unit of one coulomb. It's a big unit. So, if you have a negative charge, especially electrons, if you have a negative charge, you can form one coulomb. So, if you explain it, you can imagine it in a bag. You can fill the charge in the bag. Q, 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 and you can fill the charge in the bag. And you can fill the electrons in the bag. If you have a negative charge, you can fill the charge in the bag. That's what I can see in the example. Okay, so next thing we will do is use the equation to 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 use the equation. Q is equal to NE. Q is the number of electrons. Okay, number of electrons is equal to E into the charge of electron. E is equal to 1.602 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb. Okay, this is the charge of electron. So, if we want to use the number of electrons, Q is the value of 1 coulomb. If you want to use the number of charges, if you want to use the electrons in the box, that I can call it as 1 coulomb. That's what I want to ask you. So, what do you do? What do you want to calculate? N is equal to Q by E. Okay, that is equal to Q is the value of 1 coulomb. Substitute it, divide by charge value 1.602 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb. Substitute it. Okay, coulomb to coulomb cancel it. So, n is a number. So, it is a dimensionless quantity. So, divide it by 6.25 into 10 to the power plus 18. Okay, let's see. Plus 18 number of electrons. So, if you have a number, if you have a charge in the box, we can call it as 1 coulomb. Okay, we can define it as 1 coulomb. Okay, so, if you have a number of electrons, so, in the one coulomb is a very big unit, so, normally, we can use it as a purpose to use it as a small unit. We can use it as a smaller unit. And the smaller units, for example, milli coulomb, micro coulomb, nano coulomb, we can use it as a small unit.